Hey everybody. I went to CBS this week and I took advantage of some of the deals. Um, and one of them was the Physician's Formula. After I did that deal, I got back a $10 ECB. And I decided to upload a video of exactly what I was going to do with those $10. So that is this video right here. So I went to CBS and this is the week of September 27 through October the 3rd. So right here on the front page of the weekly ad, these are some of the participating products on if you spend 30 when you spend $30 you get $10 extra bucks rewards back so I decided to do the Pantene deal now that you need three coupons that you could find on the PNG 927 the one that we just got this past weekend and those coupons are five dollars off of three Pantene products on the actual coupon is stated that you have to get a shampoo and conditioner or a shampoo and or styler per coupon okay so I decided to get shampoos and conditioners now what you do is you use you buy nine Pantene's they are Three of them for $11 and that is with your card so I bought nine of them and I use three manufacturers coupons for five dollars off of three that is fifteen dollars worth of coupons I started off with a ten dollar ECB that I got back from the physicians formula deal and I also had when I did the physician's formula deal and they printed out my receipt I got back a four dollars of a 14 Pantene hair CBS coupon I forgot to mention that on my last video as you can see I you right there is the three five dollars five dollars off manufacturers coupons and I also had a $4 ECB. I basically was going to pay absolutely nothing out of pocket but taxes. I was hoping I was going to have a flawless transaction and it was going to be awesome and great. And oh my God, I was going to sing and walk away so happy. I'm still happy though. Don't get me wrong. Super happy. Even though I had to, uh, you know, spend money out of pocket, I'm still super happy, grateful and thankful. So... But sometimes you could plan your transactions and you could plan everything. But you know what? You cannot predict what's going to happen once you get to the store and who you're going to deal with. So at my local CBS, they accept, and at most CBS, as far as I know, they accept their expired coupons as long as they have an expire for, you know, up to a month. Or, you know, as long as they, they, they're not a month, ex they haven't been expired for a month or so, um, they accept them. But today, <laughs> woo, today, I guess it was the wrong person or something, wrong manager. And um, she basically said that one of the things that she was not going to do and that she just does not ever, 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 ever do is accept expire coupons even though my coupon had been expired what um five days not even a week actually it was less than a week so you know i didn't want to ruin my day i did say a little something but at the end of the day you gotta choose your battles and sometimes you can tell when it's a losing one. She's the manager. At the end of the day, she was going to do what she wanted to. The best that I could do is call corporate and say something or whatever. Anytime I, you know, but it was just, it was not worth it. It was not worth the aggravation. I could tell that she was not going to budge. You know, she was just going to, no, I'm not. And that's it. So I just wanted to do my transaction. I went ahead and here it is. So right there. 
after all my coupons my subtotal was four dollars a dollar and 74 cents taxes so a total out of pocket of five dollars and 74 cents now to me my total and what I paid for each one of them individually I always do my math after taxes because I'm sorry but you know when I do it before taxes I feel like uh, that's not really truthful because I did pay taxes so you know it just I don't know I always do it according to how much I paid after taxes so 574 divided by 9 basically 63 cents each I'm super happy and I also this counts towards the beauty club and since I did do the physician's formula deal and this one I'm sure I'm getting back at least five dollars that already makes it right there only 74 cents after I get that back <clears throat> plus my ten dollar ECB this to me actually is a money maker I did get my ten dollars ECB my I saved forty dollars and ninety one cents my savings value was ninety one ninety one percent and what I plan to do is to upload another video where I'm gonna let you know what I did with those ten dollars in ACBs okay well take care happy couponing please like subscribe leave a comment down below share the video Thank you so much for anybody who has decided to subscribe. I appreciate it so much. I'm trying to do my best every single day. Believe me, I aim to learn more. I love couponing. I'm passionate about it. I really, really, really cannot wait to one day just do it so flawlessly like I've seen some people do it. But you know what? It takes some time, but it's worth it. It's so worth it. And thank you so much. And have a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.